Hey there, this is K4A, Knowledge for All, Educational Videos and Tutorials. Today we will see how to import GMX, GMZ and YYZ file formats from Game Maker Studio 2 and that's what I was talking about in previous few videos and why I was making those, although uh, those sounded uh, very simple and uh, not useful, but uh, we have come come to this problem um, which I was talking about earlier and that's uh, 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 what to do when you're faced with these file formats and how to open those. Um, it's uh, actually very simple again uh, if you have watched uh, previous video you know that uh, when you work uh, when you create project new project in Game Maker and you work in it and uh, a game maker ma creates uh, one folder with project files in it and uh, the project um, file uh, in it and other uh, folders for sprites, rooms, ob uh, objects and so on but when you want to send that uh, file to someone else from your team or uh, upload it for uh, other people to to download it, uh, sell it on asset store or whatever, uh, it's much more convenient to uh, uh, compress it, to zip it, and Game Maker does that for us and makes uh, YYP project files. It turns that YYP into YYZ. YYZ means it's zipped. So you, when you are uh, faced with these uh, GMX, GMZ, which are um, files for previous Game Maker uh, versions and uh, uh, the, with this one YYZ which is yo-yo zipped uh, you all you have to do is just click on this import and again you cannot make uh, mistakes you won't be able to open YYP uh, YYP is project project files you can open it here with open you can see that here yyp okay i don't need that i need some other i don't even have to know what that is I'll, all i need is to find who can open it how it can be open so i have yyz let me see yyz oh great so i can pick for example this uh, testing gml which i made in previous video with exporting button or maybe this one DND YYZ, which is drag drag and drop tutorial, which I make uh, on my YouTube channel so far. But you, uh, if, yeah, let me do it again just to see it better. So when you click on import and pick some of those files, GMX, GMZ, or YYZ, like I'm doing right here, you click open, but they uh, the game maker asks you to make new project new file why, uh, why is that so he wants a new folder to do what he wants to extract this yyz zipped into new project file files folder like we had this testing gml you see that's a folder it has another folders in it same with this one we got the zipped file from someone but the game maker cannot work on it like that it has to be extracted he has to see all the folders all the files and so on so you just need to name it i will name it dnd no problem and uh, wait for a couple of seconds or minutes if it's a bigger file and he extracted this yyz into yyp <laughs> Uh, yeah, it sounds again uh, complicated or uh, funny or stupid, but that's how it works. It's just transferring from the zipped extract into uh, a project. Uh, this, this is the one which I was working uh, on my, although I need this one on my left side. Yeah, now it looks the same. Yeah, this is the my tutorial folder tutorial sorry project which I extracted uh, and first I um, created new project worked on it then I exported it 
from YYP to YYZ and for example I can send it to you and you can then import it and work on it and uh, follow tutorial or do something you else you uh, whatever you want to to do to change uh, so that's uh, what these uh, files means they are actually some kind of compressed file zip files which you have to import again that's the difference between opening project files yyp and importing import instead of open so there are two options open that's yyp and import yyz uh, and again that's um, not uh, something which is uh, uh, not used or um, um, uh, rare or something like that uh, if you have watched previous uh, yeah if you have watched previous uh, few videos um, i gave you the link to this windy woods uh, free game maker game template which was i think a year ago posted on game maker site so it's relative, relatively uh, fresh and new only one year or so and this one towers and monsters even uh, newer so uh, this windy woods is uh, made recently and uh, they posted it online in which format in yyz uh, that's what we were talking about today and that's how you need to import this um, compressed project as you can see when you hover over it you can see it's type uh, typed game maker studio to compressed project and it's big in uh, size uh, compared to my tutorial which is like under one megabyte or so uh, this one has lots of stuff we will see that soon uh, graphics and so on so it's 64 megabytes and you need to do what we have shown uh, here today you need to import that project and you um, we will talk about it in next few videos you can uh, get in problems you can get some kind of problems with it uh, i will talk about that in next few videos because and that's because uh, that's why i am making these kind of uh, videos uh, now because uh, not only that you need to know to uh, what's the difference in all of those different file extensions and formats and how to open or import or export or, or save them uh, but also from time to time you will uh, uh, get in uh, problems with them and this is not the end there there are actually two or three more videos with uh, this uh, um, uh, with this mess of, of file extensions but uh, I have to make those uh, as soon as possible and then uh, continue with tutorials because I don't want to um, talk about these uh, all the time I just want to do it once and when you uh, ask me or don't know you can uh, uh, go to this video and see how to import it or whatever you need uh, uh, that's it for this video see you in the next one and thanks for watching